Hey guys, Cody here with CMR Fabrications. We just wanted to give you a demonstration of our flip up. A lot of people have been asking for a video of the features. So here it is. Uh, we've been working on this flip up for a while and we're super happy to get it to market. Uh, one of the first things I wanted to talk about is how we get our lenses in and out. So we have a two spring system. It allows you to pull your lenses out of the back instead of the side. So a lot of people don't like cutting that hole in the side and you have to cram your lenses in. So you simply pull them out of the back, got your lens pack here, I'm gonna go ahead and replace it. And then you're gonna take this bent spring, it's a pretty standard spring found in pancakes. And then this other flat stainless steel spring slides into these little grooves that we have created here. And then just go ahead and press that down, slide it over and lock it into place and you're good to go. So our lens capacity is much different than others on the market. It has a 5 eighths of an inch working depth. So you're not trying to cram all your lenses in this really tight hole in the side. Um, you can adjust the tension by bending the triangle spring. So if you want your lenses really tight, um, you can make them tight or you can make them loose. You're not really pushing your lenses in there very hard. Another great feature that we've added that can, people complained about um, uh, with some of the other ones on the market is that over time and use the lenses start to sag um, we have a secondary locking system on ours so once it's locked you cannot open it and if you want to open it you simply push up and roll out super simple super intuitive super user friendly just locks down in and once it's locked there's no opening up on its own if you do not want that feature or you don't want it to lock as firmly all you have to do is take this little tab here and sand it down or remove it completely and then you will no longer have that locking feature so it's an additional option for the people who want it uh, it should benefit many many we don't recommend removing it but you guys do what you want as far as the clear lens goes to get your clear lens in and out of the back you're going to take your clear lens there's three tabs inside i know it's kind of hard to see but there's three little tabs in there you're going to take it stick it in those tabs give it a little bend let it pop under the other three tabs on the other side. And then you're gonna take your spring here. This is just a plastic prototype. The real spring will be stainless steel, but you lock it in your first tab over here. And then you take your first side and lock it under the tab. Second side, lock it under the tab. And then your spring is in place. Doesn't block your view. It's nice and out of the way, compact. That spring has adjustment. You can adjust the tension there and there. Um, it's a great feature to get it out, same thing, remove one side, remove the other side, pull your spring out, and then you can go ahead and pop your clear lens out of the way. Um, another big feature that we've added to ours, people complained about the shape of the cell storm. It always left gaps on the top and bottom of the hood. We've tried to adjust that the best that we can. And we've also added a secondary lip. It's really hard to, there it is. It's really hard to see, but what it does is it goes inside the hood to block light. So you can see it here on this hood. See that plastic lip down inside there? It protrudes through the hood. That'll help keep any light from ever entering the hood. Um, so even if it's not an absolute perfect fit, like if you're gonna go ahead and install this on a fiber metal or somebody else's hood, um, that's not ours and it's not perfect geometry, that lip will help seal the light. Another great feature is our hood. We've designed it to where if you want to run this and not our standard lens box, you don't have to cut the hood. There's no modification. We've designed it to work with the original factory hole that's in the hood and the original rivet holes. So there's no hacking your hood apart and then you're screwed and you can't go back to the original lens box. So this fits right in the same hole and uses the same rivet holes. So there's no modification needing. So you can flip them in and out. I mean, you're gonna have to drill these little rivets out and put new rivets in, but you're not permanently stuck like that. Um, we've tried to add a bunch of features you guys have asked for, and you said that you've had problems with other hoods. Um, we also offer a lifetime warranty on all of our products, which is unheard of in the industry. So um, the weight, uh, this one currently weighs the same as the cell storm, maybe a touch less, so you're not adding a bunch of weight. People have asked about the weight. We've tried to keep it extremely light um, to match the light hood. Um, all in all, this setup is much lighter than a regular fiber metal. Um, I mean, considerably lighter. So if you guys have any other questions or comments or we didn't show something in the video that you would like to see, we can make more videos. We can also just send photos. Um, just let us know. We thank you guys for your support and